I know what it means to go through financial hardship. I know what it means to go through financial troubles. The man talking to you is not stupid. He's not ignorant. Years ago, we finished a crusade and I did not have the money to pay the sound people. They were almost going to arrest me for preaching the gospel because a dimension of kingdom wealth was not added to my understanding. The sick were healed. Blind eyes opened. Deaf ears were unstopped. But I was still in trouble. Please listen to me. No matter what level you are, there is still a higher dimension. The anointing flows from our scars. Your scar is the opening that allows the oil to flow. Run away from people who don't have scars. They cannot bless you. They can only hope to bless you. We stand by the privilege of God's grace. Unashamed from our pain and our scars. That is where the oil flows from. Death has worked in us. So that life can work in others. I know what it means to be embarrassed financially. Hmm. Sometimes God lets you go through the things you will be saving people from. That is the only way to create compassion in your heart. When you are too detached from the pain of others, the anointing cannot flow because compassion is a receipt that you have gone through the school of the spirit. And compassion comes on the wings of pain. This may be a message for some of you that what you are going through now where death ends is also where resurrection starts do not be ashamed of where you are apostle god called me to be a financial apostle but as it is right now i'm in debt of hundreds of millions i don't even know if i will survive this year listen to me many have come like you though we are few we're surrounded by many who have crossed that river before listen you are not the first to go through this i assure you there are people who have seen the end of where you are going the end is peace the end is beulah and hefzibah you will get to realms where only those who have scars are allowed to pass through that door and you will find out that many are too innocent to be blessed your scar becomes what today is an object of your shame will become the reason why a crown is put on your head do not be ashamed of your mistakes do not be ashamed apostle i made mistakes in a business i lost money don't worry see it as your school fees in the school of wisdom in the school of wisdom the vice chancellor gives you back your school fees when you finish no matter how much you paid it is given back at your graduation so don't worry about what left you is waiting for you when you collect your badge of honor a testament of endurance when you stand before men like paul you can say let no man trouble me i didn't jump classes i went through it with pain i went through the school of wisdom i went through the school of honor i went through the school of value i went through the school of diligence i went through the school of grace i went through the school of relationships i went through the school of pain i went through the school of discipline and now i stand holding a testament of god's faithfulness let no man trouble me let no man trouble me do not question my wealth because i look scarless it is the beauty of the palace that has eroded the pain of Adulam. I was in Adulam. When you get there, the next time you see someone who is down here, you can tell him I was there. Let me show you how to rise.